Hello and welcome back my fellow mages and mystics and today <coughs> excuse me we have a lot of stuff to go over first off I believe I got another ability point to spend in survival I don't think I've done much of anything else I'm gonna stay away from this here because this yeah, says you know not to wear clothes just because I, you know, it's kind of a cool idea that you don't have to wear clothes and you still get advantages. But I like the cosmetic. The, 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 the cosmetic appeal, I guess you'd say. <clears throat> so we're going to avoid that one. So all-rounder can learn one additional profession. I think I'm going to go with that. So there is that. And we have a lot of stuff in here. So first off, let's let's go in here. I'm going to turn all that that I can because I need oh this bandages all right well we're gonna do something here and I am going to come outside here I think this is all stuff I've been gathering from the castle and other ruins <coughs> excuse me we have a lot of stuff we have some longbow staves where did I put those oh I also have some stuff in here if we can get to it today we will look at that I'm looking for one thing in particular ha here they are because I want a here it is Oh, excuse me. Can I do... I can do one more. <clears throat> I don't want to do one more. I'm going to put a trunk down. Just so... I'm just going to throw that up there. I'm going to put that there. Just so I can have like a dump chest. Just to throw my stuff in. Alright, now. I need to do... I need some more sticks. And I was going to say, I think I have some more. Here. I think I needed, <clears throat> needed 24. So what I want to do is I can't do all of them. Whoops. Well, how, how long is this? Recurve 16%. Okay. Not enough. So I want to do some backpack upgrades. So I think it's the tall. <clears throat> we have the mini. And I need some sewing kits. And that is... These. I think I needed two. What is that? <clears throat> yeah, I needed two. I needed... I'm going to need four firewood and my shears. <clears throat> Or a pair of my shears. 
and those are right there. So I'm gonna put that there and do backpack. I'm gonna put that over there. And I can bring this up. Alright, that, that, that. <clears throat> and there and I should be able to do this to get the tall linen backpack which gives us all that storage and I'm not going to be able to do this for all of my backpacks because I don't have the linen <clears throat> so now we're running short on linen but that gives us quite a bit more backpack space which is nice and the reason why I haven't been doing a lot of long distance exploring is because I want to make sure I have backpack space. We have a bunch of flax that's going to be done. We're going to have onions that are going to be done. Turnips, cabbages. <coughs> this flax is going to be a while. Parsnips. So we got a bunch of crops that are going to be done soon. So I'm not too concerned about that. Let's check our rabbits. Our rabbits are still good. Our tool. Our cattails I'm going to have to harvest. And things of that nature. So now that that's done. <coughs> excuse me again. Jeez. Keep some stuff in here keep this on me I like having a couple spears that's fine so <clears throat> our flax is way on the low side so okay there's that and I believe my fence may be and one of these what kind of fence do we have over here rough <clears throat> yeah the rough hewn maple I don't need another gate so what I want to do so okay this is gonna be one two three all right well you're gonna come out I'm going to do so I want it three spaces apart one two three okay now I can three all right have more room to extend it later okay we'll put that in there that's fine and then all right let's put these up here and I take this one off actually yeah all right let's <clears throat> do this I want to move a bunch of stuff out of here. So if I take this one off, nope, take this one off. Then I can put this one here. Then I can have the smaller one <clears throat> down there. Then I can do a little bit more. inventory Jenga here I'm going to take this one off I'm 
and put that there. Okay, <clears throat> so now let's get everything sorted back to where I want it. I put the gears here. That can go there. That can go there. That can go there. Then I want my materials. And the bag can go there. The butcher's bag. So eventually you're going to be able to make a six slot and an eight slot bag of these, <clears throat> which are going to be nice. But the four slot one for right now for us works good okay inventory sorted the reason why I did that because I want to be able to take <clears throat> one of the small ones off and get these okay alt four <clears throat> put that on there put that on it goes invisible for a time being but that's fine so we'll get another skip into that uh, we got the one that's here uh, I believe that the other one is down in this village so we could go and do that that's quite the hike I'll do that between episodes I, I believe I showed you what that's gonna be like already to do so <clears throat> another thing I want to show you is we got some work on this I got some black currants and I'm going to transplant these bushes because <clears throat> they are in the way and just for the moment I'm just gonna put them back away from this because we have a building here that I've started this is gonna be our first <clears throat> shop building. This is going to be a butcher shop. And this is just placing blocks. I'll bring you back when I put more stuff into it. And this is going to extend right into this. Well, this is our building here. But it's going to extend that way. As you can see, this way. And we'll bring in this. I have copper, so I'm going to go and do some copper mining between episodes. I took a trip, a little exploration trip. I found slate in this area. Peridotite, peridotite. The slightly green stone <clears throat> in this area. And there's something here that I'll look at at some point and yeah that's just basically over this hill here's the other village uh, I've been slowly breaking this down this is a ruin and just basically collecting material then at some point I'll go over in this direction as well to explore see what we can find uh, resources I'm looking for Okay, there's bees down here. There's bees here. And but to get bees the quote unquote <clears throat> natural way, there's something you gotta do. First off you gotta have some cattails. Which I have some here somewhere. And you need a little bit of clay. So we'll put the clay here. And you have empty skeps. So we'll put those back in there. And the other area <clears throat> where the bees are, I'm going to collect some of these 
wild flowers on my way there just to put some more around the beehive in the wild. Do I have my armor? I have my armor on. Okay, I'll leave that on for now. In case we run into something scary. Like a bear. Um, there was a bear that I killed that was sleeping right in there. It spawned around here somewhere. And... Yeah, I have no more dirt. Uh, this is not dirt. Okay. I can get some right here. Okay, that's good enough. Okay, the beehive is... I think I see it. Maple branchy leaves. I'm just trying to see the beehive. Which tree is it? The beehive is here somewhere. That's another gooseberry bush. Oh, you can really hear it now. Oh. Ah, there it is. <clears throat> we'll get the mushrooms. We'll get these sticks. <clears throat> Alright, now. I'm going to put these skeps down. you got to put the skeps down. Then you've got to put flowers by them. this out so we can see a bit better okay now nearby flower is zero <clears throat> it'll update population size poor eventually in a few days these bees will travel into these skeps so we can pick them up take them put them back home so that's part of what I wanted to do today to basically upgrade our bee population because we're going to need more than one beehive working and I'm thinking about getting three and then just keeping some skeps uh, populated To have on hand. Okay, more flax seeds. And 
and I seen some more cat mint. So I just want to harvest up some of these. So we can have them ready. I heard something. <clears throat> Alright, now we're going to run home. Like the chickens that we are. Oh yeah, I have a road. And I plan on working on the castle. <clears throat> but... Ah, uh, yeah, we're hungry. I have... I have stuff, so... Let's go in here. Alright, yeah. That's a nice amount. Some more maple seeds. Another vine. All of those. That's fine. Um, let's just eat a couple berries. Okay, I'm gonna leave it so we have six. Okay, that's starting to spoil. That's fine. I also have. 12 snake meat because I was picking up sticks and stuff okay that's almost spoiled okay that's good that's almost spoiled these are gonna last for a long time that's not we check that we have a lot of spelt grain. Not so much of this. Uh, I'll eat the almond mushroom, sure. These are spoiling to get rot, so that's fine. Let's throw it in there. Alright, now. That reminds me. I want to do a little experimentation with some stuff because there is something that I want to do. So while we're sleeping, I'm going to take a drink of water. Stay hydrated, people. It's very important. And get a meal. That's not a meal. So now I want, I'm going to take this, okay I have something on my back apparently. something on my back. I'm trying to place it. How can I get that off my back? It is not letting me. <clears throat> it's not letting me. But I have some chickens here. So I'm going to grab this. 
and we'll put some of that stuff in there okay I have three chickens and a baby rabbit okay there's the baby rabbit a rooster and two hens so all right we'll put that in there <clears throat> so I have I want to grab I'm gonna grab three flax grains. And two of these. <clears throat> I can put that in there. That's fine. I'm going to grab two of these and I'm going to grab a stair or a slab and I'm going to figure out how to make a stair out of okay I need clay and some stone okay I have some stone I have some clay so we'll put that there put that around I'll throw that in there and I'll grab that I just need one stair okay so what I want to do is we have a hole alright so that can go I'm just going to change that to that, and that's fine. <clears throat> First off, I want to do this. Oops, no. First off, I want to do this. And then that. <clears throat> I want to put a storage vessel here. And okay. Now, for 114 days, that's 151 days. <clears throat> now, if I put a storage vessel down in here, is that going to make it? Oh, that is. So that works. That counts as a basically a miniature cellar. So you see up the top, storage vessel, stored food pair speed, 0.76.8. 1.02 yeah that works so what I can do is I can have above ground storage doesn't have to be underground so what I can do in this building since it's going to be a butcher shop, is I can put stairs here, maybe pointing this way, right? <clears throat> put the vessels down there, and if I have stone, <laughs> okay, I can't pick them up. But I can do this. It's low weight. It's still three meat. All right. So, but yeah, <clears throat> that was one of the experiments that I wanted to do because <clears throat> I seen somebody else do it on the video. I can't remember who. Okay. I can chase the other chickens away. This is right around where I caught the chickens that are in my traps. Okay, that's good. A 
I can do this. All right. So, snake meat. <laughs> You've seen me going around. If you like right click stones, that's a chip, that's not a stone. If you right click stones like that, you see worms. You can gather worms, which are fishing bait. But occasionally, it won't be a worm that you that you'll dig up. You'll actually dig up a snake, and they can be a couple different kinds of snakes. Uh, poisonous, non-poisonous. That's a good way to get worms, and they are fishing bait. And I believe you can get it from sticks too. Oh, more almond mushrooms. That's fine. I will gather mushrooms. I'd like to get six. And we're back down by our bees again. So. But yeah. It's just. What it is. But yeah, like I said, I was going around. Picking up stones and it was raining I was getting worms so that's how you get worms for bait <clears throat> and if you do medium temporal storm is approaching but I was gonna go and do something but we are going to get home I'm gonna call the episode here and in the next episode, we will face our first temporal storm. If logging out doesn't uh, make it disappear. And we will do some other stuff with some of this other stuff. And we're going to do some more copper working and things like that. Maybe go prospecting, maybe dig up some more copper. And things of that nature. So until the next episode, guys, I'm going to get off of here really quick. And I will see you in the next episode for the temporal storm so talk to you then and stay magical stay safe have fun and talk to you later bye